Hi! Welcome back to another little fashion chat. I have to uh, go back to the office in person. And I was realizing that it's been two years since I have had to think about dressing uh, for the office for summer. You know, trying to find outfits that work for 35 degrees on your lunch break and then 22 degrees in crazy aircon in the office. So I have to look like I know what I'm talking about in my whole person now, not just this much of me. <laughs> so that is today's video. So the first look is the always trusty midi dress. Midi dresses are so great in summer for work because uh, you look put together, but you're also cool and you don't have to worry about uh, flashing anyone. So I paired my midi dress with Brokes from Baird because I just feel that this makes it look a little more professional and work appropriate than if I wore sandals. Midi dresses also work perfectly with blazers if you want to put that on, if you've got, you know, like a presentation or something. But then also if the aircon's too strong, you could put a unbuttoned shirt over the top, maybe like a white linen one, or you could even just chuck a cardigan over the top. Super easy. So yeah, if you want if you're looking for like the one piece to add to your summer workwear wardrobe, just get a nice midi dress. Second look is another midi cut, a midi skirt. Midi skirts, like midi dresses, great for work, keeps you cool, looks professional. Mine is from Ganda and it's the slip silhouette, but also with a little split on the side. I like this paired with a high neck sleeveless singlet. I feel like the whole silhouette looks really professional and I'm super cool in it. I don't have to worry about sweating on my lunch break in this one. Because it's um, not very colorful, it's all black and white, I sort of made the look a little more interesting with my gladiator sandals. They're from Baird, so they're super, super comfy. I find that silk midi skirts um, are actually a little too warm for summer, so if I can get one, that's a light cotton or a cotton mix but this um gander one is perfect and just like the midi dress this look works so easily with a black blazer or a black cardigan or or even an unbuttoned black or white shirt just over the top just for when the aircon is crazy and this look could work for some of the corporate girlies out there you could you could wear that with a blazer, easy. My next summer work look is cropped jeans and a light sort of blazer to make it look a little more professional. The jeans might be a little hot for those over 35 degree days, but this um, is a super easy look because if you're wearing just a singlet underneath, you just take the blazer off while you're on your lunch break, while you're walking to and from, so you don't sweat on it. I really like this look because the pastel blazer really goes well with the light blue denim. And then the sandals with a little bit of a heel just like make it look a little more professional. This is really the most basic outfit. It's just a white singlet with some cropped jeans and some sandals. But this colorful blazer really like adds to it, makes it look like a proper professional look. I really feel like a light colored blazer like this in a lightweight fabric is perfect for summer at work. You could even leave it at work and just pair it with uh, whatever basic outfit you're wearing that day. It could just be a white singlet and plain colored bottoms every day, but you've always got this nice colorful blazer to just lift it up, make you look a little more purposeful in your look. This is another jeans at work look because I can wear jeans to work. I think solid colors, so solid white, solid black, maybe a solid navy, elevates the casual denim look and makes the jeans look a little more professional. So these are my white Levi ribcage jeans. Because it's summer, I've paired them with a super fun printed short sleeve shirt. I think printed short sleeve button up shirts are another great summer work addition because a lot of your button up shirts for work are long sleeve. So if you grab yourself a few short sleeve ones, it's gonna be a lot cooler, but still feel a little bit put together with the whole button up look. And then to just finish it off, make my legs look long and make me look a little more professional, I'm wearing my Hush Puppy sandals with a little bit of a heel. And I really like this look. I think it's really fun while still being professional, you know? I'm wearing a button up. The jeans are a nice straight leg. Look number four is for those super hot over 35 degrees days. This is work appropriate shorts. 
and I have never found a pair of work appropriate shorts before so I am excited by these they're from witchery and why I consider them work appropriate is not too tight they're not denim and they're not too loose like a drawstring or a paper bag waist I just think they sit really nicely and this color and this cut they're gonna go with a lot of things because I was planning for a super hot day with this look you know 34 degrees I've just paired it with a singlet high cut sleeveless singlet in navy and I think that looks really nice the dark top with the neutral shorts instead of just plain black and then you could easily to counteract whatever aircon you've got going on you could layer a linen shirt over the top and when I'm um, choosing to put a linen shirt over the top of my outfits, I like it to match the color of some part of the outfit, so the shorts or the top. So with this case, I went with a navy button up and I think that looks nice. But these shorts could easily work with a plain white button up, a structured white t-shirt, a, you know, high neck top and a blazer, or even a fun, flowy summer patterned blouse. So yeah, I'm in love with these. And that is it. That is my whole week of outfits that I'm going to be wearing to the office. Well, that was really fun. And I actually feel like I'm excited to go back to the office and dress up a little bit. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and I will see you on the next one. Bye.